electrical energy definition of electrical energy and examples of electrical energy before starting the lecture click on the subscribe button and get access to our hundred of conceptual lectures for free firstly let me teach you the concept of gravitational field we know that there is gravitational field around the earth and everything falls towards the earth present in the gravitational field for example consider an object present on the earth surface let i do some sort of work on this object and lift it up does this object experience the downwards gravity force the answer is yes it experiences the downward force of gravity if i release it it will accelerate or fall down towards the earth center so we say that this object possesses potential energy this object is present in the gravitational field of the earth thus more precisely we say that this object possesses gravitational potential energy at this point when this object falls down its gravitational potential energy is converted to kinetic energy thus from this example we learn that if we do some sort of work on an object in gravitational field gravitational potential energy is stored in that particular object now let me teach you about electric field consider two charges positive and negative according to michael faraday there is electric field around positive charge and there is also electric field around negative charge we know that like charges repel and unlike charges attract here let consider a big negative charge we know that there is electric field around this negative charge if i bring a point charge a small positive charge into this electric field what will happen to this point charge well the negative charge being large in magnitude will attract this point charge towards itself now listen carefully i want to lift this point charge up in this electric field as i did in the gravitational field what should i do well i need to do some sort of work on this point charge and it will get a vertical position in the electric field let the height of this point charge is h now this point charge at this position experiences the downward force of this negative charge as the object experienced the downward force of earth's gravity so we say that this point charge possesses potential energy this point charge is present in the electric field thus more precisely we say that this point charge possesses electric potential energy if i release this point charge it will accelerate towards negative charge and its electric potential energy is converted to kinetic energy from this example we learn that this point charge possesses electric potential energy and kinetic energy let me repeat it this point charge possesses electric potential energy and kinetic energy and this is also called electrical energy therefore we define electrical energy as the stored potential energy and kinetic energy and a charged particle is called electrical energy let me repeat it the stored potential energy and kinetic energy and a charged particle is called electrical energy now how can we obtain electrical energy from this point charge well when this point charge accelerates towards the negative charge we utilize its motion or its kinetic energy remember that when charges flow from one point to other point this phenomena is known as a current or electricity for example the bulb will convert the kinetic energy of charges to light energy secondly the loud speaker will convert the kinetic energy of charges to sound energy thirdly 
electric heater will convert the kinetic energy of charges to heat energy. Thus, we therefore say that electrical energy is the stored potential energy and kinetic energy in a charged particle, which we can convert into other forms of energy. This was all about electrical energy.